There's something new in the cereal aisle. New nutrition labeling. Kellogg's and General Mills have started front of the package labeling on cereals so that you can tell at a glance which cereals might be best for you and your family. The idea is that consumers can quickly see what's in a serving of cereal and how it contributes to an average adult's diet. When you look at the package, the first four nutrients are nutrients that most of us need to eat less of, so look for the lower percentages, while the next two are nutrients that we need more of, things like fiber, iron, and calcium. These labels make it really easy because you no longer have to pick up the box and turn it around to look at the nutrition facts. But there's one difference between the Kellogg's and General Mills labels that Good Housekeeping says you should look for. Kellogg's chose to give the total fat on the cereal box. And total fat really isn't an issue. It's always low in cereal. And General Mills put saturated fat, which is more important because it's the artery clogging type of fat. So look for zero on the label. It's your best bet. Still confused about making healthy cereal choices for your family? Some cereals don't list fiber on the front. So if you want to find out how much fiber it has, look at the nutrition facts. The same way, look at the ingredient list and see if whole grain is the first ingredient. I'm Elizabeth McGuire for Good Housekeeping Reports.